God, I love, like, this type of synth music. It's so good. Welcome back, everyone. My name's Fo Show Shot, and today we're checking out The Pier House, Episode 2. Uh, you might have seen me play the first one. It was in the Three Scary Games. Uh, it was very good. I really enjoyed it. Love the style. Everything scares. And, ooh, this is pretty cool. It's like I'm in it. Uh, and yeah, I want to play the second one. How do I click? Oh my god, it's literally... I'm here. on the. I didn't realize I'm like a character on the screen. Sensitivity is... Whoa. So low. What do we got over here? Play part one. Play part two. Play part three. I don't think part three exists. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, hold on. Okay, well, without further... I want to look around here. Let's just... Let's get into it. Hold on, wait, what? Is this just straight up starting it? Walking forward? It is. Oh, that's really cool. The Pier House Episode 2. Was I really in hell or was it just a dream? I did see that demon from hell last night standing next to me. Hope it was just my mind making things up like it's usual with sleep paralysis. Whatever. I need to get this job done quickly. Sophie isn't getting any better. See, I don't understand that. Like, am I... Did I like, um, let me just, uh, <laughs> he just gets out of here. So he went to the hospital. There we go. That should keep me a little bit safe. Oh, so I just, I went to the hospital, made sure I wasn't crazy, and then I boarded up all the windows, except this window. Oh, because that one, I thought this was a curtain, but it's actually like metal on there. Okay, that makes sense. So he said, Sophie isn't getting better, which is my daughter, which I know from the description, but it never said in part one that I was doing this for my daughter or anything. Oh my God. What? Did the radio just ask for help? Did it? I didn't hear that. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, whoa. Why don't you just calm down? Dude, I hate when it's to the right. It literally sounds like it's inside this room. God, is somebody out there? Oh, that's fun. That's a fun thing that's happening. Can I just leave? Just let me leave. I, uh... Okay. Yeah, why am I still here? I'm pretty sure that's not where I left my EMF meter, but all right. Is he trying to tell me to find him? I don't know how to use this. All right, then. I should scan around. If the body's still in the area, it'll generate electromagnetic fields. Would it? Would it? I feel like it wouldn't. How do I turn this on? How do I turn you on? Did I get on the boat? Hmm. Well, the boat is boatable, it seems like. I might just need to fix that at some point. Maybe it'll just pop on when I'm out here. It doesn't seem to be... Oh, maybe it's already on. Like, it'll just register once I'm near something. I keep doing the... Sorry, my my eye is just watering and itchy for some reason. I keep trying to do the, uh, the phasmophobia thing, like the uh, right click. 
But that's just zoom. Let's crouch. Oh, it is just on. No, is it? Is it actually through, like, the woods? I was just joke. Oh, it actually is through the woods. I am going uh, the right way, I guess. This does not look like a path that you would take at all in a game. Like, it's not giving me very much information at all that this is a correct path. Also, it's clearly the wrong way like there's there's something blocking me from going forward maybe i was supposed to go this way there's something out here oh this is fun Oh, God. Come on, man. I'm sick of this shit. Fucking like animals, of course, they do something like this. Yeah, can I like, cut you down? At least they were caught by the police, right? Can I cut this down? I'm sorry. What the hell is that thing? Was I not supposed to see that? It looked like a, like a like an angel or something. Uh, you're starting to roll. Yeah, there was like something in the sky right there. What do I do? Do I just take it back with me? All right, man, you're coming with me. What happens if I put you on this uh, sacrificial table? I should bring him to the house. Really? I don't even know how to get back to the house. Is it this way? I'm instantly lost. Is the house Ugh. don't break your ankles I'm so lost <gasps> I'm, I'm back okay I made a shortcut Poor guy. Don't worry, buddy. You'll soon rest. Will you? Need to burn the remains. Should dig a grave first, though. He deserves some respect. Wouldn't you, like... Damn it, I left my shovel in the car. Wouldn't I... I hate walking. Wouldn't I call the police? Like, this is obviously a body they missed. don't like that it's obviously a body they missed and they need to i mean this person's oh we already covered this that's just a deer either that wolf's cold hasn't gotten any better or it's just a deer man it's something way worse and i'm in danger well uh... man i'm way too comfortable around dead bodies and demons and stuff i didn't read that last sentence oh my God. 
I should get back as fast as I can and get that fire going. Wait, what about the shovel? It's what I think it is. The only thing that can protect me is fire. You know what? On second thought, is this an ending? Fuck this. I'll just make meth? Three months later, Christian was caught with a pound of shitty meth and sent to prison for life. Well. This marks the end of the second episode. I really hope you enjoyed it and had a lot of fun work. I had a lot of fun working on it. I didn't say they did, but I assume. Maybe I'll see you again for episode three. Hold on. I need to go back in. All right, I'm out. Enjoy the music. The music's so good. Obviously, I just need to get, like, the normal ending is what I need to do. All right, I'll see you back where we were last. Yeah, that's like a goddamn demon angel thing. Like, what is that? Okay, we're back. We got his body here. And then... I should dig a grave. Okay, so I need the shovel in the car. Not gonna look. I don't care about you at all. Oh, I wonder if that angel devil thing's still around. It's something worse and I'm in danger. Oh yeah, I'll get to read the last sentence of this. Hold on. And wait to go. I'm even making shitty jokes now. <laughs> God, that got me again. Okay. Um. Ah, you had to open the back door. If it's what I think it is, the only thing that can protect me is fire. What do you think it would be? Like a Wendigo? You think it's a Wendigo? I feel like a fire would protect you against that, right? It's becoming more and more active. But then there's that weird demon thing that angel demon that was flying in the sky. Dude, I'm already here. Wow, I got it. Eerily quiet. Even the grasshoppers have stopped. Oh, well, that's not ominous at all. Whatever. Let's get this fire going. Where's the fire? Holy shit. There's a demon still inside of him. <laughs> what do I do about it? Cross? <laughs> what do I do about it? How do I get... Did I just die? Don't tell me I have to restart. Oh my god. Oh my god, and Sophie died too. That's the end of it. Yeah, let, okay, okay, cool, cool. Let me try again. No, you didn't put an auto save in? Oh my god, okay. That is very annoying. I think it, I, I understand you want people to like play your game. This happened on not this game or not the previous game. I think the previous game before that, I'm unsure. But there wasn't an auto save. And so you had to like keep going through the game to get the other endings. And it was, uh, it was very annoying. Cause you don't, you're not scared anymore. When you, cause you know what's coming next. Yeah, you might accidentally um, forget the scares and stuff. And then when you have a scene like this that's unskippable too, that's kind of annoying. Like he's, you can skip cutscenes and things in this game, which is great, but you can't skip 
this part. I have to sit here and wait for this to go through. I also can't uh, skip, like, getting the body. After you get the body, that's where there should be a... A, um an auto save like where you could if, especially if there's multiple endings you want to that's that's a good midpoint i think god damn though that fucking the knocking is so good okay so it's the sticks on the ground i'm assuming is what i need to uh do something with the fire right yeah yeah i hear you out in the woods we all know you're gonna murder me Especially if I don't get this fire going. Like, what would... God, I'm just so confused on... Because I, I tried to click on him, right? Okay, well, just know that I, I only have a couple seconds to figure it out. Or else I get murdered by something. So. Okay, so it is these. I pick them up. You're, you gotta be kidding me. This cannot be the, oh my God. What is the end? I'm so frustrated. <laughs> it didn't even let me. Oh my god, it literally didn't let me even pick up anything. It just automatically murdered me. Alright, we're on our way back with the shovel for the third time. God. Um, luckily, this game, it doesn't take too long to honestly run back. but It's like four minutes or so. But it's still something you have to go through every time. There definitely needs to be an autosave. So the only thing I can think <coughs> is the cross. I must have not have like picked it up or clicked on it fast enough. So I'm checking. I wonder if it's the cross is what I need to pick up. Once he's all demony. Because I went for the fire first and that messed with me. Okay, okay, yes, it is. Now, the power of Christ compels you. Oh my god, what? What? What am I getting killed by? Is there something behind me like that I'm just not seeing? Oh my god, I have to do this all again. It's fine. It's fine. The game's fantastic. But holy hell. I'll see you back when we get there. Okay, back to this fucking thing. Keep my back to the pier house. Whoa, whoa, that was some weird lag. Every 30 seconds or so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It wouldn't let me pick. I'm going to give this one more chance. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is going? I'm not. I'm done. I'm straight up done. I'm done with this game. It's so. Oh, my God. Oh. 
I do want to see something before I quit this game. Um, it says play part three, which I'm super kind of weirded out about. Wow, I got it. Oh my god. <laughs> You're joking. You're joking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I saw it. I saw what's been killing me this whole time. How did I just go too far from the fire? Is that it? They need to make this more apparent that that is literally the part like there's little auto save feature in here it just doesn't tell you about it but i'm super confused on why i'm getting murdered by this monster See, it says, oh shit, the fire. I wonder if I have to put down the... Maybe I have to put down the crucifix? Are you... F oh my god. Am I an... It's cute. What on earth? Why? Why is it Q? Why is it not E? Why is it not a click? Why is it Q? Also, it's fine. It's okay. Also, how did I click Q and never realize I was clicking Q? You know? You little dick. Fuck, I don't know how long 30 seconds is. Shit, I accidentally put in another one. Please stop it. Am I doing it? Am I getting it done? I mean, it probably is. Not something good. I mean, it probably isn't good. Are you what? Did I not do it? It's because <laughs> Fuck.
I'm done. I'm done playing it. Um, God, it sucks so bad because this game is awesome. I love the style. I love the scares of it. But, I mean, I get that you don't want to, like, like, have to handhold or walk, like, walk people through your game, you know? You want to be able to be like, okay, they know how to play the game. Let them know. This is, by the way, a very cool intro. So cool. Um, like, main menu screen. It's very awesome. Let them know that, hey, if they'd like to try the different chapters of it, the, to check these out. Ah, music is so good. Uh, also, let him know that Q is the button to pick things up. I have not used Q once in this entire, in the previous chapter, I don't think, or in this game, or in this chapter. I never used Q at all. Like, it's wild to me that Q all of a sudden, we just forgot about E. We we're like, no, Q's the button you need to pick that up. I guess that kind of makes sense. Maybe ease your right hand and cues your left hand for the sticks. But, like, so weird. Such a weird concept. And then the mechanic of, like, going in here and just dying. Like, I drop the sticks in and I die. I wait 30 seconds. I wait till it tells me that I need to. And I die. It's so, it's so finicky. And it sucks because I... I loved the first game. I also really enjoyed this game up to this point. Um, and, like, not even a 30-second timer. I get that you want to, you know, you give you some, you some, give someone a, like, or you give the player a notification, like, hey, the fire's going to go out, do it. But it's so, like, finicky on if that works or not. Like, it's wild to me. This this te this just becomes like a fire making simulator, that uh, and not a horror game, essentially. I'm gonna try it again. I guess I guess I'm trying it again. This was my outro, um, and yeah, I'm trying it. Like they could add a. Uh, I don't know. I honestly, I don't know. Like, because I'm doing everything that I think is correct. And it's also not like a countdown timer, right? If you drop the last stick in, you die. Like, essentially. If you had missed time to one of these sticks, at least my understanding, if you miss time one of these sticks and you make it to the end, you die still because you miss time to one of these sticks. Again, that might not even be it. Maybe like the sticks are piling up too high down here where they're not being counted as being in the hole. And so it's still counting as the fire going out. See, I'm going to put it more here so that hopefully it doesn't go out or it doesn't get caught up or anything. So I think you can kind of see the fire going out too. I don't really know. But it kind of looks like you can see it going out. Please tell me I get this correct. I do it? That's all the sticks. Oh my god, I did it on literally the when I was quitting. Quitting the game.
You good? Oh, you just walked away? What is that, by the way? Oh, God, my fucking ears. Ow. Give me some tinnitus right now. Jesus. Well. This marks the end of the second episode. Jesus! I'm still so annoyed. An hour and 20 minutes. Ugh. Man. Alright, everyone. That was the Pier House. We actually somehow made it to the end uh, after all of that. An hour and 20 minutes later. God dang. Um, yeah, I think it was just too finicky. I think it's a fantastic, cool idea, the fire thing. Um, but it needs to work like 100% of the time. Like, it can't be finicky. You also need to let people know that there is a literal, like, autosave thing to the left because I didn't know that. I literally thought it meant the first game, the second game, and the third game, like, telling you, hey, you know, wish list or more information about the second, the third, like, chapter. Ah, but regardless, I still loved it. The scares were great. The music was great. It is a free game, and you're getting, like, like, if this was on Steam, you'd be paying, like, four or five bucks for it, probably. Um, this one... I, I really enjoyed, I just think, yeah, it needed to be a little bit tighter around that, or be a little bit better at explaining to your, you know, the players what they're doing. You want them to enjoy the experience, and there was definitely a big portion of this video that is cut out that I was raging hardcore. There's a couple times I literally just yelled, fuck, just loud, because I could not figure it out. Um, yeah. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and share. On our way to a thousand subscribers. Um, if you'd like to play this self or this game yourself, you can find a link in the description below. What else? Oh, check out the playlist above for three scary games. That's it. That's all I got. I'm ending this video here. Have a wonderful evening. Wow. Wow. Wow.